Hey there guys, Fave here, and today we're going to talk about some eggs. Now, I'm sure you might like eggs, green eggs and ham, eggs, bacon, grits, sausage, eggs, fried, scrambled, fertilized, doesn't matter. We're talking about eggs today, so today's challenge is, if you've ever seen an egg before, smash that like button. With that being said, let's talk about eggs. As the egg hunt's coming up and a few of the new eggs have leaked, we're not going to talk about those eggs. We're going to take it all the way back to seven years ago, to 2013. What were you doing in 2013? I remember a few things about 2013. That's the year Grand Theft Auto V came out, my favorite video game of all time. That's the year Thrift Shop by Macklemore came out. That's a song. In 2013, I literally had a Minecraft series on my channel that ran for nine episodes called Faves World. So if we go ahead and play this here, we can hear me just talking. Hello there, it's V here. And I've wow, I've been doing the hey there guys fave here since 2013. Hello there, it's fave here. And yeah, so if you want a dose of old, old school laggy, ugh, fave. Yeah, fave's real. There's nine episodes. It's a whole playlist. But anyway, let's talk about the topic. That's the year they had the Harlem Shake. Now I sound like a boomer talking about what was going on seven years ago. Y'all are probably like babies or something. I don't even know. But... You know, that's what I was up to. But also in 2013 was the 2013 egg hunt. Now, from what I remember of this event, it was a big map. I spent a lot of time searching for eggs. And it was okay. I mean, at least in my opinion. A lot of people liked it. A lot of people didn't like it. I don't know what the general consensus is on 2013's egg hunt. But it was okay. I mean, it was acceptable. It was definitely better than some of the later ones that would come. So, but the really cool thing about some of these rare roblox eggs and the reason why i'm calling them rare is because it's been seven years a lot of people who play roblox now did not play back in 2013 so although they're not rare in the traditional sense most new people do not have these eggs anyway so let's talk so these rare roblox eggs hatched into free items so let's take a look at this first one so at first this was like an alien looking egg I, it kind of looks kind of gross, like a booger that's been chilling in your nose for way too long, and it was going into your brain, how it has a brainly shape to it. But this was what it originally looked like, and then it hatched and became the alien hatchling. This thing looks really cool. I don't own it, but I'm going to go ahead and try it on, just to see if it looks cool on my avatar. Even though, if it does look cool, that'd probably be sad that I don't own it. Oh, this thing looks nice. Looks like one of those masks people are wearing to prevent getting the coronavirus. Like, just protect your breath, don't breathe in the infected air, that type of stuff. I felt that. Okay, that's cool. So then, you have this egg that says forum on it. So for those of you that are unaware, the forums were a Roblox feature back in the day where people could discuss things with other people. They removed this like two or three years ago because, you know, it got really wild to say the least. And so this egg turned into another egg. Well, it hatched, okay? Just like an egg hatching into a little baby chicken, this egg hatched and it became this. It became a speech bubble, which actually makes a lot of sense when you think about what the egg was. Because it was an egg with a lot of words talking about forums and words and stuff. And when the forums speak, we listen. Alright? And so it turned into a speech bubble. Because when you talk, well, there should be a speech bubble over your head unless they turn off bubble chat. And I own this, so I could actually wear this. So I'll put it on. The original speech bubble, not the UGC one, which I like too. But this one's the original. So if we take a look here at me wearing the speech bubble hatched too long didn't read egg. That's what TLDR stands for. You can see me just talking up a storm. Isn't that what I'm doing right now, if you really think about it? <laughs> then you have the Sorkis egg, and I remember this egg very vividly. Now, Sorkis was a Roblox admin back in the day who was very famous and well-known and pretty well-liked among the users. So, of course, he had his own egg in 2013 at the peak of his popularity. You can see him with his straight face, looks like he's thinking to himself. Kind of cool, right? So if we go ahead and take a look at what it hatched into, we can see that it is the Sorkis stool. Now apparently I don't own this one either, so I guess I didn't spend that much time with the 2013 egg hunt, but it, it, it turned into a stool, and I don't know why. So it says the stool works best as an enhancement in your trolling with the Sorkis chair on your epic troll journey. So they're encouraging people to be trolls, which I guess that's cool, I'll accept the lifestyle, but dang, it's a stool, it's a gear. So like you got this just for owning the egg. Very cool, very cool. Then you have what is known as the egg of scales. 
and as you can see here it's a green egg with wings on it with ridges all over it and it's really cool looking it was already a cool egg to begin with I wouldn't mind wearing it as an egg but what did this become did it become a bird a plane a dragon I don't know but if we take a look here at what it hatched we can see Scaly the dragon bro now this is really cool I'm not even gonna lie to y'all this is a gear that you can just ride on okay all right, the eggs of scales hatch into Scaly the dragon, born from the roots of earth, and scales like the steel of Anabaris Scaly descends upon thee with glorious power to wield. It's a ranged gear. I mean, you can fly around all day on this thing. Wee! Wee! I mean, why don't they just hatch things nowadays? But I'm not done yet. I got more items that hatched, okay? We're not even, we got two more to go, okay? So. Then we have the Egg of Duty, which is also another cool looking egg. If you've ever played Call of Duty or know anything about soldiers, it's just an egg decorated as a soldier. He's a three star general, not a five star one though, and has grenades on his side. It's a little violent considering Roblox is supposed to be a kid's game and all, but I think it's a really cool looking egg. In the bottom half of him, I can't even see it. It's like half an egg. I don't know. Where is it? I can't see it. But what did it hatch into? Well, let's take a look. Bad Blocks Hatchling, Hatched Egg of Duty. Now I like this even more than the original, cause if there's anything I like more than humans, it's animals. Cause whenever I'm watching a movie, I get way more sad when an animal dies versus when a human dies. Look at this cute little thing, oh my god, it's literally hatched out of the egg with a war paint and a bandana on. Is that animal abuse? I don't know. But look, this is the, oh it's so cute. I wish I owned it, but I don't. It's also a gear. So let's see what I look like holding this gear of some sorts, this bad blocks hatchling. Well yeah, um, you can see me just posing and there's me just holding it. Now I don't know wh how I'm holding it, it's like standing on air. I don't want to assume that my fingers are going somewhere they shouldn't be going, but but in reality, th this is weird. I don't know, my owl looks jealous of this new little hatchling, so I'm gonna go ahead and put him away and move on to the next item we're gonna talk about, okay? This is the last one we're gonna talk about for today. So, oh, but by the way, did y'all know that my owl's name is actually Kahoot? Cause you know, an owl goes hoot, and if y'all know what Kahoot is, then you know, all right? But anyway, the last egg. This was known as the Wizard of Astral Isles egg. So think about those nerds and geeks, which there's nothing wrong with being one of those, that are into like wizards and medieval stuff. So this is an egg that appeals to them. And I like the hat on them. I mean, I don't like the color scheme, but I like the idea of it. This egg has a personality of its own, rocking the belt and the hat. I mean, it's cool, but you know, I'm glad this one hatched. So what did it become? Well, I actually own this one. It's called Confused. Hatched Wizards of the Astral Isle egg. And yeah, this definitely looks like someone who's confused. You ever watch a cartoon and someone gets hit or something and they get all confused? Well, this is what appears around their head. So if I were to try this on, I would think that it would appear around my head. And yeah, as you can see, I'm going to go ahead and put this on too, just for the sake of the video, alright? So we have the speech bubble, we have the, the confusion, we have the, the bowler. I mean, this is a sick outfit. This is a really sick outfit, and I, I like it a lot. I'm gonna respect it, I'm gonna respect it, I'm gonna respect it. But yeah, with, with all of that being said, I wanna know, which one of these hatched eggs, hatched items, free Roblox items, was your fave? And yeah, I know I made a fave pun, I've heard it all before. I can make puns on my own name. You can't stop me. Are you looking forward to this year's egg hunt? I mean, let's go ahead and take a look at some of the eggs that have already leaked this year, just as a little bonus at the end. Now, there's this egg called Ninja Egg. Now, we're not sure if this is real, but as an egg, I guess it looks pretty cool. He's got the little Roblox cheese it on his forehead with his pupils not even existing, and he's a ninja, I mean. What do you think a ninja does? He's got like the katanas on his back, looking real intimidating, and I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda scared of him, so I don't even wanna talk about him anymore. I'm gonna just chill for a bit. I'm gonna be real chill, still chill. Alright, so thanks for watching. Let me know what you think down below about all these eggs and their hatchlings. If you, what you're thinking about this year's dev egg hunt, whatever. It's 2020, man. It's wild living out here, okay? So make sure you smash that like button. Follow me on Twitter, at RobloxFave. Join my Discord server, discord.gg slash fave. 
you know, join my fan club on Roblox. Follow me on Roblox. Uh, my username is Fave with two A's. And, oh, gee, where's my voice going? <laughs> and it's your boy, Fave. I am out.